good to everyone and um, thank you for the blessings the blessings that you are pouring on me is so great so much i am so grateful i'm so grateful as many of you that are blessing me praying for me thank you very much and the same lord who made heaven and earth the god of the god of ever isaac and jacob jesus christ of nazareth we pour this blessing to you in abundantly in Jesus' name. Amen. And I want to tell you guys, please, don't stop sending this lovely message, this blessing, these prayers are so lovely. And I want to tell you that Edes was so touched. Edes was so touched. Edes was reading some of your comments. How you people were really encouraging her. I was showing it to her as she was nearly crying. She said, wow. People in Africa love me a lot. I say, yes, they love you. And I'm going to come with her to Africa by the grace of God. I'm going to bring her to Africa. And um, she's going to see Africa and uh, also follow us. Because she used to follow us in most of the things that as we go around the world to preach to people, we go around the world to do the things that Christ has said us to do. Um, and that is why we are called consigned people of Christ. We are consigned people of Christ that we go out there to make sure we reach out to people and uh, to the orphans, to the less privileged, we reach out to as many who are crying before God. We reach out to them, pray to them, comfort them, and find a way to assist them in whatever way we can. And also, if they are into any kind of problems, any kind of problem like this one of Mary, we see that by His grace that they are treated fine, that they are treated fine, and they will not go through this thing, not by our own power, the Bible says we have no power of our own, I have no power of my own all power belongs to Jesus that made heaven and earth you know one thing I'm saying the Bible says in First John that they say in the beginning was the word and the word was with God, the same was in the beginning, all things was created by him I think I need to rephrase that thing again, let me come back uh, most of the time I, we used to have like a kind of fellowship, a kind of fellowship. And if you are, if you watch my life, you see me where I'm like, we are doing our fellowship. We used to do fellowship and then um, people come and we do our consigned fellowship or it's about Jesus Christ, consigned people of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. So we do fellowship. We, um, this is, so you can join us on live. If you want to join us on live, we'll always be on live on Sundays. You can join us online like today we were talking about how you can overcome how you can overcome we're talking about overcoming so you can join us online every sunday we are online by 11 o'clock we are there and we start preaching we start preaching by 11 30. we start taking subject preaching encouraging people through the word of god by 11 30. so if you don't join us at 11 by 11 30 we should go online we should be online by 11 30 preaching the word of god by 11 30. So 11.30, you will always see us on live. Starting, um, we have already started it from every Sunday, every, every Sunday, every single Sunday that we do this. And this is the first time, for a long time anyway, uh, we had to come on live here. Uh, we started live just Sunday, yes, uh, Sunday, and then, uh, but we have been like reaching out to people all over other sides through other social, other medium forms, and we have been doing that. And also going to meet on face to face, one on one, both not only in Africa, but in Europe, in all part of the world, in every part of the world that we have people going through this kind of thing. So I want to say that is why Edes is part of us, and you can see Edes that the way she's glowing, happy. Yes, she went through a lot. Edes is an orphan who has gone through a lot. She started being an orphan at a very very tender age, and um, it was not really easy for her until she find us. And when she find us, we took her. She was even she she was younger than them, and we gave her all the support of mo what a mother should do for a, a child, and the support of all parents what the parents should do. And since then, she has she has. It's just because I had to ask her to that was why she started crying. Since then, we have helped her to offload by not by our power. God have helped her because of the encouragement, world, the support, and everything we are doing. So she has really eased herself and she has really confined in us as brothers, as sisters, as a mother, as everything. So today, 
I was I, I didn't want to bring it out, but it just it just for you people to see that yes, that it's not only Mary. That you need to see the pain of an orphan. I just wanted to people to see the pain of an orphan. How often go through. Because they don't have nobody. So anybody they find in that time is like a brother, is like a sister, is like um everything to them, like a, a mother to them. So they confine in that person. And when they do not see, they don't have a voice. The Bible says they do not have a voice. Like I want to go back to that voice I was saying. That chapter, the Bible says in first John. John chapter 1, sorry, John chapter 1, he said, In the beginning was the word, and the word of the God, the same was in the beginning. All things was made by God. In the beginning was the word, and the word was with God. And he said, in the beginning was the word, and the word was God, and the word was created by God, and all things was made by him. He said, in him was light. And the light could not be able to, in him was life, in, so in him was life, and the light could not be able to comprehend. You understand me? In him was life. I want to speak this, in Christ was life, and darkness could not be able to comprehend the, the life of God, the light and the life of God. Darkness could not be able to comprehend it. Everything was created by God. Every single thing, even the clay, every single thing on earth here. If we have plain today, it was from the from the word, from the inspiration of God He has given to us that today we can create praying, we can create this, we can do get science, we can get it. But some people do not believe that it's from God. Everything that has happened has already been created by God, already designed by God. And that is why the Bible says, Who can battle with the Lord? Whatever thing we are doing, we should not step in God's toes, please. Whatever thing we do, it is very, very, let us not step in God's toes. Let us not step in the God's toes. Because when you step in God's toes, wow, nobody will, even the governor, the president, the world president cannot help that person. When God starts his battle. When God starts the battle on, the, on, on Pharaoh, on Pharaoh, the king of Egypt, then he saw what he had not seen before. <laughs> he was, he was, he was saying, whoa. He thought it's by power. It's not by power. Have you forgotten that the power, all power belongs to Jesus? He created both heaven and earth. He created, he removed king and bring put king down. And that is why, if you watch what's happened in the days of, uh, uh, the days that Jesus Christ, the Bible said Jesus was preaching, was preaching, and there were 5,000 people. And after the preaching, they were preaching, and it was time for them to eat. They were hungry. And the disciples, was telling Jesus, Chase, let them go, let us send them, let them go and food, let them go back and eat, let them go home and eat. The Bible says Jesus was so compassionate. He, said, he rebuked them, he rebuked, he rebuked the disciples and said to them, Stop! How will you tell them to go? How what strength do you think they will? How do you tell them that they are hungry? He said, Give them food to eat. And Jesus, the disciples were looking at him, eat and others. Say, This man, is he okay? Is he okay? Is he okay? That we should feed. <laughs> Where is the money? You see, because they are men of little faith then. That was then, not now. But now they are stronger. God has God trained them. Jesus trained them very well. And they be, Peter, John, and all of them became strong in the Lord. And they have strong faith. But before then, when they do not have. And somebody from nowhere, a little child, a young child from nowhere, had the same faith of Christ, had the same compassion of Christ. And he brought three loaves of bread and two fishes in a basket and he gave it to Christ. He said, Christ, this is what I have. When I was coming, this was what I brought to you. So I want you to use this and feed everybody. Oh my God, what a beautiful soul. I wish all of us can, many of us can be like this in the world. The world will be a better place to be. People will be eating, feeding. You know, people will not be hungry. People will not go through all these things. I'm telling you, I wish the world is, I wish people have, have that kind of mind. Like a lot of people. I know that people have that kind of mind, but not a lot. Not a lot of people. It's not a lot of people. I wish the whole world would be like that. And Jesus accepted it and was pleased with the guy. And he lifted it up and said, Lord, thank you for this food. Thank you, Lord, for this food. What a wonderful God. You are thank you for this food. And he gave to the disciples and said, share it to them. Why they were sharing it? Why they were sharing it? The angel of God too was sharing. <laughs> Why they were sharing, God was providing. Why they were sharing, God was moving. And before they could know, 
several baskets of food was to be ate and they were filled up. Am I going to talk about the miracle of Jesus Christ? What about the one he did to, during the marriage? During the marriage and the, and, and they were, the, the wine, the drink were finished. And when they were complaining, Jesus came and saw the whole drum, and the whole pot and drum of this thing was finished. And he, and he told them, please go and fetch water and fill it this thing, and they were looking at Jesus Christ. First, what is it? Water we want to drink? Is it not? Is it not? Is it water I want to drink? Is it not wine I want to drink? And they went to the mother and started telling the mother, telling Mary, that see what Jesus is saying. You see that thing that he says people should do? Go and do it. Obey that instruction. You should. And as soon as they obey the instruction of Jesus Christ on that day, they put the water. The water began to turn to wine. And when they were drinking it, they said, eh? Eh? So this morning, this morning, all this kind of sweet, correct wine, correct wine, you are hiding it from us. <laughs> because the wine that came from heaven is better than the one of the earth. <laughs> and they were drinking, and they were so happy. And it became the best marriage so much. So what I'm saying is that it is good for us to, if you see whom to help, please help that person. If you see whom to have compassion on, hope to compassion on. Do not be biased. Don't be biased. Don't say because. Because if you put yourself in those people's shoes, if it were you, what would have happened? Put yourself in their shoe. Put yourself in their shoe. Put yourself and say, God, if I were this person, wait for my sister. And that is why I said to you guys that if, if Mary Mother, because when I saw Mary Mother, I said, wow, if Mary Mother was still alive, and the father, do you think that they will allow their daughter to go through this? They would have come. Because the way I saw that woman, that woman, I knew that she would have come and took her daughter out of that place. And it would not have been easy for Lemon to just marry their daughter like that. Because he, he will go through scrutiny, scrutiny. And as many that are marrying an orphan, they should please look at them like their mother, like their sisters, like everything. Yeah. Sometimes you see them, they become angry, they go sad because they are thinking of their sister, their brother. Yeah, we have another person that lost his um, family on a plane crash and God was with her that she didn't go into that plane with them. She didn't travel with them and that was how she, and that person today, we are comforting that person. We are comforting that person. Person, we are comforting her very well, comforting her, talking to her, and for years that we have been talking, she has gotten herself too. She has gotten herself. It is not easy. You can't imagine making her happy in every way. We put her in school, everything to do so that she can be happy. What her mother and her father should do, by we are also doing it for her. I'm not here to announce because the things of God. I'm not here to announce because I'm not. The, we are not. The, we are not the consigned group that consigned to come to announce what we are doing and what we are doing. Because the Bible says, "Let everything be done in secret." He that sees in secret will what openly. It's God who sees in secret. I'm not the kind of type that will come out and announce. Oh, we do this. We do this. We do this. The reason why I'm saying this, the reason why I pointed this to one two, was because of what is going on. Yeah. God of what is going on, that is why. If not so, mm -mm, I will not because we do everything in secret. Because we know that he that rewarded is God. Who that rewarded openly is God. So we are not ready to say, I did this, I did this, I did this, I did this, I did this. I don't want to be like, oh, and you have, have your reward. by right? People say, thank you to you, you now have your reward. No, I want the reward to come from God in heaven. That is where I want that reward to come from. Anyway, guys, I just want to say thank you to you guys. Thank you very much for many of you that have been praying for me, sending me so lovely. I am so happy. I am blown away. And you have encouraged me. I am blown away. Anyway, guys, I've come to react to another video that is here. Um, and that guy is called Tenny. Is it Tenny that is named Tenny? Um, Lord of Lemon Friend that was in that same place. I'm not talking of the wise one. I'm talking of Tenny. Is it Tenny? They call him Tenny. Yeah. That have, was there with them 
I want to react to his message. First of all, this guy, you were the cause of what happened between um, Mary and um, the uh, Mary and Lemon because Mary, I know Mary told you something that you should play that you want to prank his husband. Fine, but you know that she doesn't know much about pranking like that. That was why she called you because she knew that you are a type that we know it. And if not, she would have called. And the wise one does not do prank. I've not seen him done prank, but I know he's a. Um, is a, a film pro producer or director or something that he do. He go for script and all those things. But and if you have called when you when he called you, he called you. You should have informed your friend. I know that some people do prank. They say prank. They are not supposed to be involved in. They are not supposed to be informed. Quite knowing how your friend is, knowing that your friend is a type that we not see it like a prank, because he said they are not seeing it for a very long time. You did not even. If you have informed you didn't inform me and that was that was what brought prank um, brought this problem that lemon had to come back and see two of you in this room in his own bedroom stay well why i'm saying this i'm not going to go back to that i'm just telling the reason why this is happening now you come you come they, you were called you thank god you say you were called when something happened, emergency happened, the first part of call, at that very time, your brain is thinking, how do I survive? How do I save this person? How do I save? So whatever thing that comes on your brain, that is what you are going to do at that time. Now, that is what you are going to do at that time. And at that very time, they rush, them, um, Mary and the wise one rush Lemon from the house to the hospital. To the hospital. And when they rush it, they didn't hide it. They were, as they were rushing Lemon, they, start, they called you. Thank God they said they called you. I want to, there's one word that I want to, I want to, to clarify. Thank God say they called you. They called you. They called you. You were rushing. You to rush to that place. And they told you the name of the place. They called it the family and the family came and when you came to that place you saw that treatment was being going on already on him and the treatment that was going on on him today that treatment has what revived him to to talking because you were not he just recently started talking about about the place and no place and how it was and this thing I never see you talk like that because the last time that Joy was there saying, What kind of hospital is this? That, 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 what kind of hospital is it? I saw you, you were against Joy, telling Joy to go out of the place that this will go. They are making noise, they are making noise. But I was surprised to see your twisting. Okay, let's put it you were caught and you go to that place. And when you get to that place, what is the next thing you are supposed to do? Are you not supposed to know how much they are, how much is the bill, what to do, and what to do? Are you not supposed to know so that you can just contribute your own money without you even being asked? And you are waiting for them to answer you that you should bring money. You never. You are coming there every day, but you never bring one P. And that was what this thing. Because they are the ones that brought him. And when they brought, they, they called you. And when they were called, they called you because they wanted you also to assist. Because they know that lemon patronize you with your own business. They wanted you to assist. But they will not just come and ask you to assist because they do not know your are your capability at that very time. You rush there. So if lemon lemon, if I was there with lemon and lemon would by the, let's say example I was there, lemon is my friend, I was there with lemon. Even if lemon is not my friend, I would say I see lemon by the grace of God. If lemon I was there with lemon, I I will know that yes, I need to support this I need to see that yes. That this thing is being done, I need to support, and you did not support. Okay, you come there morning, night, every day. You say you go, you stop, you come there morning, or you stay there till night, you stay all day. Have you ever bring a flask of food? I've never seen you bring a flask of food, a flask, a flask of food. You come from your house, you go back home, you do. You don't even buy something road or like orange or whatever for your friend. I never see you. I only see you come with shop liquor and that's your day and you come alone and that is how you come. You will stay there, sit down there and when you are hungry, you go and eat your food and come back and your friend, you have not 
One, you did not give. I've never seen you say, oh, I paid this money, you did not pay. Food, you did not bring. Then the wise one, the two people, people that are carrying this girl, sorry, that carry lemon, and Mary and that carry lemon, rushed into the hospital and took her own money. Mary was showing her account how much she has taken out of her, her money today, how much she has taken out of her money to pay. That her own account. She took money, took her money, her money, with the wise one, they contributed and paid money for him to be rescued and start calling the family and bought food for him to eat and make sure it's an every time they want to make sure that you can see to the wife and say have you eaten i'm not going to go and buy me food this man will come to the house to cook have people done that no okay fine you did not do that now you came there and you were saying about the um you came there and now um, lemon has woken up as lemon has woken up you are there still talking about the kind of the hospital is that what the doctor is supposed to have the doctor is supposed to have thank you god bless you doctor for making my friend to making my friend to come up there was nothing like that to the doctor now the environment of an hospital did not did not quantify the capability of the hospital that same instrument you are saying because their instrument is you know the instrument that they used to wake him up listen I don't say that. I don't know why you put that. When I've gone, we go to hospitals to see people. We go to hospital. We go to places to visit people. That's why I've seen a lot of critical condition that is even more, more, more than a lemon. Yeah, I've seen critical conditions, and it's it's a gradual process. As far as as far as the doctor can be able by the grace of God to make him stand, to make sorry, to make him not stand, to make him talk. Open his eye and talk, and he was crying. He was crying. We talked, telling his brothers everything that happened, telling this thing. He was, he was. Then what again? Do you think the daughter will not do? That is the first thing. As far as he come, oh wow, thank you, you. You don't expect, you don't expect someone that will pass through that thing. Okay, fine, fine. Let it. This was something that was developing in the body, and we let assume that. Like Mary and uh, Joy was claimed, uh, they were saying that he, he, Joyce was denied, still saying now he was the one that was told that Lemon told him at that very time. Joy did not take any effect, did not take any quick action. As even though took quick action, he wouldn't have gotten so weak like that. So the thing was growing with his eye was red and his thing was growing, I was red and that thing was growing. I didn't mean he was rushed down to the hospital or taking that or walked out to the hospital, drive that to the hospital by there. It wouldn't have come to that level to his, to his uh, family doctor. It wouldn't have come to that level. They would have subsided with tablet or war and they wouldn't have gone to that. But because it has gone to that level, what do you think? After waking up, there will still be weakness of the body. That thing you see that that man is putting on his body, those drip and everything is what will make him listen. I've been sick, and I, I did not get, I did not stand up immediately. I was not stand up immediately. I did not get strong immediately. It's a gradual process. It's a gradual process. As well as the drops are being put in the body, it's a gradual process. So I do not know what you are saying. I do not know what you are saying. That that the, that the, the wise one and Mary has a. Another interior motive. What kind of interior motive do they have? Interior motive that they involve the mother, the parents, unless is it because Alice don't want to be on the day. They involve. And how do you think that you can be the one to do? listen? There is nobody that doctor will listen to that is that is not the one that admitted. Is who admitted the person and signed. That is who doctor listened to. So don't come here to tell me, tell us that you change the room. You are the one that told them. To, no, no, no. They don't do that. They will not listen to you. They will not listen to you. The doctor will only listen to person that that and and I wise one have already told them with this that they should please change the room for him. That was an emergency. Emergency brought to the hospital, restore him, and now they are changing it. Well, if you talk of moving him. To the doctor, nobody said they should not move it. It didn't even stop the doctor from this because doctor have seen people maybe because you have people are not explaining well to him. If everybody, it, the doctor explained to well, the doctor, that private doctor can come to that place, to that doctor, he can come to that doctor, and the doctor will tell him. Or you don't even need to call the doctor. The doctor can have the phone number and talk with him. Two of them can talk and he can tell him what 
medicine he is putting on his body, what he is putting, what he has used, how far he has gone. The doctor might say, okay, let me come and check. They will just, they will not allow, but they will just, okay, fine. If this is what they give it, he will say, okay, soon the size will transfer to you. This is what I've got. Even if the doctor, the doctor will still write, the doctor have to write what he has used on him. And everything, that boy is being documented. He, when he came, he was given a card. It was really stark. It was so, it was true document. And the doctor, even if he want, even they want the doctor, the, the child, the lemon to go out of that place, according to you people, because you people are so disturbing, you people are so disturbing, feeling that you want to take glory. Yes, that's what the, the wife was saying. Yes, that you people just want to take unnecessary glory here. Yeah, unnecessary glory, and it was bad. It was bad. And you are saying that, uh, what did you say again? You said that, that um, Mary, that, um, that um, Joy left the house when the thing was not accumulated, when the thing was not serious, that he was okay. How was he okay? Hey, listen, how do, how do sickness start? Does it start at once? Does it, hit? So it starts gradually. It starts gradually to give you gradually. Maybe sometimes it gives you a sign. It's a gradual something until you become accumulated. So we leave the rotten rotten on the other. So it has got to happen. That was why he fell on the floor. And thank God the, the doctor said some people used to die that he did not die. Nothing happened to him. So they should what people should do, people should not be making noise there. That's the only thing people should do. You should not be making noise there. Because the more noise you do, the more reflection, the more things that you people are bringing out and making him to remember all those things is also helping him to go down. It's not helping him to restore. So you put to stop, stop shouting, stop bringing back things, stop letting him talk about things. Not this time that he's supposed to be talking about whether this one should go, this one should not go, or this one should stay. This is not at the time. This is the time for prayers, the time for uh, comfort, the time for all this. That's what will happen. And now you put a dragon. Who and who and who? That is not done that way. It is not done that way. So what am I saying? What am I saying? I'm telling you guys that, I'm telling you that you should reframe your talk, reframe what you have said, and be thankful to God that your friend was alive. You can't just sit and start siding. You, are, you, are just, you don't even, you're siding joy. You can't do that. You can't just sit and start siding joy for nothing because you are, oh my God, you are, you are saying, you are saying as if being, telling that the, the, the money that uh, Mary was using was from the the husband, but Tuesday money was opening an account where all the money, where his money was being going, his own account, I saw the name, his own account, where money was going out. How money was going out? How money was going out? What I'm saying to you people is this, is that I don't know what you people are dragging there. I don't know what you are dragging. I don't know what you are dragging. Actions speak louder than talk. It is not about hey, this one and that and that. They no, actions speak louder than talk. It shouldn't. All you do is without having any assistant to help your friend, help your friend, help him, and encourage the doctor to continue. Or if you guys want to let the doctor do a, 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 a proper documentation and transfer, and let the other doctor know what has gone through these guys, so that the doctor will know to, to continue from where the doctor stopped. It's a shared things. Even you will see, I'm telling you, as far as the transfer, because you see that doctor will tell that doctor, thank you. They only say thank you to them. They say thank you for the thank you for the thank you. Yeah. Even sometimes doctor will tell you, if you go and meet the doctor and say, ah, yeah, the doctor will tell you, continue your treatment. The doctor will say, yeah, continue, continue treating. You are really going to the life process. Yes, yeah, the doctors, they used to do that. You don't, people don't want doctor to meet together, to do together. Yes. And the wise one is very smart. If we can see, Mary, so smart, saying the same thing that if a doctor really wants, the doctor will play ask with this doctor. It's a very simple thing. Okay, they want to have to do Even if people want us to live, we can't just take him out like that. We have to go through the same process of documentation and discharging. Why? The doctor will not just do it. The doctor have to check him very well. We have to check him very well. And write what is remaining. And write the drugs he's going to use. Sometimes when we want to talk, we should know how to talk. In this social media, I really, I really make people to, you know, 
I wouldn't call educated literate like one of my fans told me here. He said to me, it is called educated illiterate. Thank you very much for giving for that word here. Yeah? Thank you very much. I'm not really like calling people, but there are people that are called educated illiterate that they feel they are, but they are, they don't really know what they are saying. I thank you for that word because I was really looking for that word for a very long time. What we should do now is be calm. Be calm. Look that over after that boy. Thank the doctor for what the doctor has done. The doctor has been great. At least he needs, he deserves an acronym. He deserves a thank you. Like Nigeria used to say, acronym. Me, I just had this from Nigeria, acronym. I said, okay. Me, I don't understand. I don't know how can I mean. I think it's thank you. Somebody should tell me if I call it thank you. I don't want to say something. You understand what I'm saying to you? Yeah. He deserves a thank you, a big star for restoring that and making him to talk. Then the rest will go. The rest will work. What do you think that? And in Igbo land, I want to let you know when you talk about property, in Igbo land, like I know, if you don't have a child, you don't have a son, a son for the husband, for the man you marry, the women are not liable to any property. Do you know that? So I don't know how Mary will go and take property or Joy will go and take property. I don't know how Mary will go and take I mean Mary, I don't talking about I don't know how Mary will go and take property. Except it's, it's, except it's Lemon who give him the property. Not like unless they, unless they are divorcing or when they go to court, and that was why Mary would have told him that the property you think are, is with um, the document are with his his family. That was what he said. You see him doing the right thing. Even if he has, let's assume that he got he took the document. Let's assume that he took the document. But he said the document are with the family. He gave it to the baby. It's Alice that told you whatever. I don't know. And then we did not see that part. Because sometimes Joy would just come out and frame something. Why Joy was running away from who? Joy was running away from the parents of Lemon because he know what he had, the bomb he has dropped. So what are you saying? Why are you trying to buy favor? Because you know your friend had not, like your friend also used to say, he said that, your friend said that he, he forgive but he, he do not forget. He did not, he don't forget. He forgive but he never forget. So you are trying to buy favor because you feel that your friend like you feel that your friend like so you want to be on joy side for you no no that's not what some people do you can't grow like that you can't grow like that when you make people like a god to you lemon is not god lemon is not lord it's just i don't know is it called is a lord of lemon i don't know where he has lord, lord. that is just a, a, an acting name it's a it's a um like it's a state name and uh, it's just a friend the, it's just a friend and uh, you, that is why you need to tell him the truth you have to be yourself. So let him see and see the truth and say it. For me, that doctor has tried a lot and he's doing well. He's doing good. He's doing good because I, my in my home, in my home we have a lot of medical people and I know what what medical is. It's not I'm not a doctor. I didn't read medical doctor. I didn't read medicine. I never read medicine. But in my family we have a lot. Of, so I used to go to this and not only that both of the experience that I have I've seen a lot of critical cases like I said to you that I've seen this survive as far, it doesn't matter whether it is small bigger as far as they are capable of handling that situation that is the most important thing they are saying so go and spend that go and spend money for your friend please go and pay yeah go and pay and buy food when you are going don't just dress or do this thing and you are going empty handed and you wear the good chain for us wear good chain plot your head and do fine boy for you. That's not what will heal your friend. No. It's not what will heal him. Yeah? It's not what will heal him. This thing that the wise one, the wise one and Mary deserve an acronym. We love thank you very much. They have done good great with that doctor. Yeah? They have done. So guys, I need you to watch this video and listen to Tiny or what they call him, Tiny, and see what he, what he was saying. See what he's saying. And from what he said, I need you guys to comment to see if what he's saying is the right thing or if what he's saying is good or if what he's saying is the right thing i need you guys to comment on this comment on this 
and tell me if what he said is the right thing. Maybe I am the one wrong or something. I don't know. But if what he's saying is that what I know that what I'm saying by the grace of God is is a right thing. But I stand for the truth. Like I said to you, we always stand for the truth. So guys, thank you very much for everything that you have done. Thank you for the coming. Thank you. May God bless you all. Me and the desk is saying God will bless you all. Thank you. Thank you so much. Until I see you in my next video. Bye. Alright guys, it's me Tiny, part of my friend, and I'm making this video to address something. Something very, very, very important. And as most of you know, or might know, since this whole thing started, I've not pointed a finger at anybody. I'm tr I was trying my best not to point a finger at anybody because they told me the whole story that they say it collapsed in their hands, which I don't know any part of. All I, all they did was call me and I came to the to myself. And since the day I came here, I haven't like, I go home and come back immediately to the hospital. I, I'm, I was trying my best to be there 24-7 with him. But for you know the most part, I have to go and take showers and do the important stuff. And for during, the, during all this thing that's happening, I've not tried to point anything at anybody. But things are really taking a turn right now. I don't know if you guys have noticed, except there's a bias in... I don't know if the, you guys out there have a bias, because if you notice, most of wise ones talk are trickish. I don't know. We don't say native the first shot I don't know if I've not heard that talk before. Native the first shot How can we be here and they talk say everybody's the, the form good Samaritan? I don't... I don't get... Like, <laughs> it's all of us now they try from good person because he eyes are open. We are here before his eyes open or not. This is whole matter is taking a tone which I don't like. And if you notice, we think they talk about throughout the whole time. We think they talk about throughout the time. I say, he paid money. How much he pay? This one, that one. See, guys, guys, uh, I'm really, really. Oh, my. All he's saying is how much he pay, waiting to the amount he drop. Can you imagine what he said? Like, your friend's life was at risk, and all you could say is how much you pay and how much what you do for him, how much you drop at the hospital. Can you believe? Can you believe what's coming out from his mouth? Um, see, this sincerely, if, if I should take my time to look deep into the matter, I feel like it's way, way deeper than what means the eyes because it's how much you pay, how much you pay. Maybe that may be this reason why Joy went out to the public and asked, like, for help. Because I was like, why would she do that? I don't think we needed that. Even if Lemon recovered, he had more than enough money to clear off the bills. The same money, money that Mary claiming that, okay, she paid. May you, you, we both know that you don't work. You get, and so we know that any money that you're paying is from, is money. Maybe the money he gave you, maybe you're with his card or something. I don't know, but any money you're paying is from his money. And why is he shouting? He follows support. Only God know how much he supported with. I like seriously. If he, if why is come and talk how much he actually put for that money? Maybe we know, because trust me, I know, I know his fans, I know his family, and I know they will pay him to keep his mouth shut and let him. See, we won't even see him again because the fact that he comes every day to point fingers at that place, it's it's so absurd. Like seriously, you come every day to just to find to point fingers. Why? Why are you the first point fingers? After I came out one day, I say when I use one. No, boy, if you come here, just the point fingers. See, I which joy do joy go church, joy do this one. Why is it the same day that she went to church? That was the day he collapsed. Yes, she knew he was a bit sick. But not that serious. When I did when she come out to go to church, I don't know if she went to church, like I said. I'm not sure. I'm, I'm not just saying about some of you are saying I'm picking sides. Well, there's no side to the story. Why am I picking sides to the story? I'm, I'm not close to any of them there. My only friend here is the moon. So I don't get what I'm saying I'm picking sides to the story. So for most of when I really pick side, you should come down and check out the story very well, well, if it's correlating because now the day we join come off our house, nine collapse. And like I said there, if I was there, I would have bring him myself. 
I don't even take this. This now me to God. Trust me. Guy, move, you know, like that hospital was, was giving him bad odor. If you are held here instead of hospital for two days straight, you get sick. If you don't have strong genes, you get sick. Trust me, you get sick. Then imagine a sick person in that kind of hospital. Imagine that you went to hospital and the air you breathe in could make you sick. We have to tell you, tell you that, please, this place is not convenient enough. Can we find another room and take him there? We pleaded. Joy was with me when we pleaded, but she was not there when, I, when they took him to the other room. You get. She left home to do her. No more, like I said, even me to go home to, like, change bits. I'll still come back for him there. So you get. I was the one during the way they changed his room. I was like, because I will, it was so fucking terrible. I don't know if we just don't want to put this the address publicly and all that. If not, if most of them are come there, I don't say crowd will choke. We now will support the fact say they need to take him out of the air immediately. Even the room which we took him was like the best room we could find in the hospital at that moment. As I'm saying that, okay, yes, doctors have tried their best. I'm not condemning them, they did their best. He's not able to see, able to talk. But him himself now, you know, when I talk, say, please take me out of here. I don't want to stay here. And when I see the fight make on our land here, why, why, why are you guys after the fact that you want him in the hospital? See, eh, this matter passed with him, it's I have no good life for Because if you know this hospital, this hospital, the inside here, they hit it. I'm not saying, I'm bringing out all this thing now because these people are coming out trickishly. You're rushing to point fingers. I come, this one, tell me, say, so they talk, who I be? You get why don't you come out and say what I'll be with how they talk? I'm just, I didn't want to put the hand out since I didn't want to say what it was, but I enjoy was saying it, but I didn't want to say it. But they came to hospital, which was very, very like, it is even far from his home and far from his family. Like, his family hospital is way closer to his home than that hospital. So, the fact they didn't take him there at first is very, very. <laughs> hey, God. How do you go on that plash? I was, regardless, all I know is my friend is getting better. And like I said, I'm in support of Joy 100%. I know this, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, see, I'm not against me, but whoever want my friend to be better now will follow, do you understand? And since he's part of, since he's like, she's part of his main family, which is his wife, why, why, me and wife are just friends. Me and no come, they act like, say, we're not just, we're just friends, we're not, we don't have that much ties to internet like his wife's. So, since the woman not talk, say, she's in agreement with me that, okay, let's take out of his hospital. Just hospital is not conducive, even for a healthy person, not talk of a sick person. So, if you take him out of the hospital, I'm in 100% agreement with that. So, I won't try our best to take him out of the hospital as soon as possible. We tried talking them out of it today, they don't agree. So, trust me, we will try our best, by the grace of God, tomorrow, on failure, we will try to come out from the hospital. Uh, whether ambulance or no ambulance, we will take him out of there because that place is, that place is bad. Like I said, why don't, and um, uh, if I come here, all our fans will start watching me like I'm a bad person or something. I'm just saying, I'm not trying to call you guys out, but you guys are acting like this more to eat and what means the eyes because what? I'm all, you guys are acting seriously funny. Seriously, seriously funny, bro. <laughs> but no issue, dude. No issue. What was there? What was there to the end? You say the brother cannot pay the bills. I know that if I come at the back of Joy and say, okay, Joy actually needs help. I know he fans out there. I know people actually really love him. Trust me. Even without a single penny from me, they will treat him to like perfection. Take him to even the best hospital. I, I trust his fans. I know what they can do. You get me? So I know what they can do. So you come to tell me that if I pay 10k, I go take the drink. <laughs> Why is that your point? I oh, see, come out and see how much you pay for his hospital bills. You are just happy because the fact that yes, is awake. I'm happy for that fact. He's awake now and he's able to talk. And he's saying with his own mouth. I don't want to be here anymore. Simple. What they came out? What they came out? He said it's his own mouth. And I'm, 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 I agree with him. His second wife also agree with him. And yo, even why don't like Joy is not his, is not his second wife. I, see, that's not even a matter I want to go in. That's that's none of my concern right now. What I know is that I'm in support taking it out and by the, by all means we're gonna take him out of the hospital tomorrow. Whether or not we will fight him, whether I don't know how he's going to come out, but we're gonna fight by all means. Take my daughter's hospital tomorrow. So I I don't have to do a personal contact, but I think I should try and get that. So after I will talk more, we'll know because if she, I, okay, I can reach her on Facebook here. So I'll try and do that. I'll talk to her directly so that when I will come out, them from the hospital immediately. Because since it's really out there that, that isn't agree, that's agreeing that we should take him out of that place, which is not only con, not only not conducive, but also not proper. See, 
Japanese here is terrible. I know what I'm saying. Like, if you don't go speak to Shijuku, no tech talk about the equipment here is look at from the videos you can tell for the equipment here are terrible. So guys, I'm just gonna keep you guys updated and trust me, demo head is priority number one. I don't care whatever properties we're into they're sharing or how much they pay, whatever they're saying. Is that is number one priorities and that was that's what me myself I'm after. So I'm going to just always keep you guys updated on it. So thank you guys for the support, for the prayers and for all. I'm gonna keep you guys pasted on everything. So thank you guys and bye for now.